answers my questions. Um, advice for explaining, advice for someone explaining their subdom relationship to their friends. I don't really have much advice. Um, I feel like it's one of those things people either get it or they don't. And if they don't get it, then you're just going to kind of be wasting your words trying to explain it to them. Um, when it comes down to it, it's none of their fucking business. Um, so, I find that my greatest response for people who are offering criticism and, and things like that um, to something that they don't understand is that it's it makes you look really stupid when you criti when you're criticizing something that you don't understand because you, it 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 doesn't make any sense to do that at all. It's like you don't understand this, so how and or why are you offering criticism to this? It's like talking about something that you know nothing about. I, it <clears throat> anyway, they have no no place to give criticism. It's none of their business. Um, if they get it, they get it. If they don't, they don't. That's it. Next question. Um, I was reading some old form form spring questions of yours, and I noticed a few times you made a point to emphasize how we're not monogamous creatures and how the expectation of monogamy can <coughs> strain relationships. I have to agree, but I think you've changed your. But do you think you've changed your mind on that at all? I ask because I've read more recently that you wouldn't be open to sharing your daddy or sleeping with anyone else while you're sleeping with anyone else yourself at the moment. Maybe it's just circumstantial. Sorry if I've misunderstood. Um, I've come to um, realize in the past couple of years that um, me making that statement is fucking stupid um, because it's not true. Um, there are some people who are absolutely monogamous and there are some people who absolutely are not. Um, and it it goes both ways. Um, I have come to realize that I am monogamous, strangely enough. <laughs> um, or that's something like that I can identify with, but I also understand um, um, non-monogamy and polyamory and things like that. Um, so I'm kind of in this, I'm in a weird in-between place right now where I'm trying to figure out what the fuck to do with all of this and what's make of it and, and all of that stuff. Um, I am open to sharing sexually. It's the emotional um, sharing that I really struggle with. Um, that and I have no interest in. Um, so that's that's where I'm I'm having a hard a hard time um, figuring figuring shit out. Um, not that like I'm trying to um, actively do that or anything else. Um, my husband and I had an open relationship, um, but we that was under like the agreement that like there was no um, emotional bullshit involved. Um, and I was totally, I was totally cool with that. I never slept with anybody else. Um, but <laughs> that's because for me, um, emotional attachment and connection are really important to me um, as far as sex goes. And I generally, sorry, I'm still sick, um, don't experience those feelings um, For more than one person at a time, unless like there's something really wrong with our relationship, or it's not working, or, or um, it's just not right. Um, but it, that took some figuring out for me. Um, I had a period of time after my husband and I split up where I tried to be, I tried to just sleep with people that I didn't. I didn't have um, any real 
emotional attachment or connection to, and I fucking hated it. It was the worst sex. <laughs> I was, it was seriously like, can we be done with this? No, I had absolutely no interest in it at all. Um, so those are things that are, that are really important, um, to me. So, um, I feel that if, if were Gino and I to have, like, an open relationship, I feel like it would be something that was very one-sided. Um, just because I am so content, um, and happy with him. I don't, I don't even see anybody else, like, in that way at all. Um, I'm not open to it at all. I don't, I just don't want it. Um, <clears throat> so, um, I'm still trying to figure this out, um, uh, but I realized that that was, um, that was an incredibly naive, for, like, thing for me to say. Oh no, my battery's gonna die, I'm gonna stop this now. Th anyway, yeah, that's it.